Scarlet and Violet has finally given us some really amazing boxes. You see, I feel like we haven't gotten an illustration collection or a special illustration collection box since the Sun and Moon era. I don't even remember if Sword and Shield had one, but at least right now we have some really amazing art, very accessible to everyone. We have this King Gambit illustration collection, and look at that, it's really nice. But we'll take a look more into this one a little bit later. And we have one of my favorite promos, Greninja special illustration. It looks so cool. I can't, I can't wait to take a look at it after <laughs> outside of the box. You know, I think the Shrouded Fable special collection boxes are one of my favorite products. Like, like I remember seeing some Sun and Moon products and we, they had some really amazing art in some of the collection boxes and then Sword and Shield, I don't remember seeing much of them. Like, yes, the premium collections, but like regular boxes, like these boxes here are supposed to be like 30 bucks. Yeah, like 30 bucks for these boxes or then the, the King, no, not King Joe, what is it? King Gambit one for 25, I think, or 20. I don't know, 20, any, anyways, between 20 and $30 for each one of these boxes and you get these amazing promos. We haven't seen that in a while, but let's open up one of these boxes here. You see, let's just start with the King Gambit one, even though it's uh, not my favorite, but still, let's just get a little <gasps> bit of a look into it. What do we get on this one? So we get about four booster packs and three promos. So we haven't opened any Shrouded Fable. I did remember that some stuff got delayed, but I believe these boxes here were not delayed. There you go. I really like these compact formats for the boxes. Like they, they just let you put up so much more stuff in in uh, <laughs> in the smaller form factor, and it. I guess it's pretty good for the environment too. I guess it's pretty rare to see this these days, but that's fine. And let's just take a look at what what is it? What is this promo? Yeah, I know, right? He's like ready. Ooh, I like the I like the foil. I don't know if I haven't touched Pokemon cards in a while, but this one feels a little thicker. So I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it's the it, art. <laughs> yeah, it's it's been a long time since we uh, did a full video on the channel. But look at that. This is so nice. Okay, there's regular promos, but this is what we are looking for here. QR code. I mean, I can't. No. <laughs> yeah, not the QR code. Like as always, you guys can have this one. <laughs> Sorry, I, I, I forgot but, how this works. Yeah, there you <gasps> go. This is what we're looking for. The special promo. I don't think this one is a special. It's just a <laughs> regular promo, but it does feel special. This is so cool. Is it bad? I don't know which is, is his head. I thought that this was the mouth, <laughs> but it's not. The head is like right here. So you see there's a little bit of that? a sword right here. This little white thing. Oh. Yeah, he doesn't really have hands. He just kind of have, you see, like, to me, I think this looks like rockets. <laughs> on. Probably some fighting gloves, yeah. Maybe with a big sword on the head. Nice. I really like these promos. We have not even seen any of the, the set list for this one. So I don't know what's going on in here. And hopefully there is uh, some cool cards. So let's just start opening. Look at that. Ooh, I like this. It's kind of like a chalk or I don't know. Ooh, Persian. Nice. <laughs> yeah, you know, some of these regular arts for this for these cards, they look really cool. Look at the tail in that last one. I know, right? They look so funny. And like I wish that some of these arts would just go into full arts because they are like amazing. But wow, look at that. I <laughs> Whoa, Sylvia's that has some here. Eevee evolutions. Let's go. Hey. Sylvian. Nice. A hollow? How? How I don't know. There? I don't know. Oh yeah, I think they're gonna have a... What is it? I think they're gonna have a EV set pretty soon. So kind oh. of, not really like Evolving Skies, but one of the Scarlet and Violet sets. So uh, that would be pretty cool. And then we definitely want to open up especially the Japanese ones of those because I just kind of like <laughs> the Japanese quality a little bit more. If it gets too expensive, because it's crazy now. I looked at some of the websites that are selling Japanese cards. And those Japanese prices, like Japanese uh, booster boxes, are going for like sub 50 bucks. And that is just crazy to see. Like not too long ago, like last year, we were, like we didn't really buy boxes for like super expensive. But uh, what is it? Is it V-Star Universe? Those were going for pretty expensive. And now some of the regular sets that have some really amazing art are going for like sub 50 bucks. So if you like some Japanese cards, I'd say that right now is a pretty good time to buy them. There is also a new set. <laughs> it's crazy how Pokemon is announcing like two, like one to two sets, like at, right after the first one barely even released, they already announcing everything. So I don't really have that much time to like 
like really be excited about the set that it is right now because we're always kind of looking forward for the uh, next thing. But I think, I don't know, it's one that has like Pikachu featuring on the, like the ETBs. And I think the Not Japanese yet. one. Oh, Ooh. Wait, what? Whoa, we have some hollow energies on this one. But yeah, I don't know how the pull rates for this one here should be. We haven't uh, opened up that much stuff. I mean, not really that much stuff. We just kind of maybe... Burn. <laughs> burn, 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 over and over. Yeah. Oh, look at this. For fruit? For fruit? You know, Never sometimes... Yeah. I just try it. Meowth? Okay. I just not try to pronounce some of the uh, names because uh, it's tough. It's tough. <laughs> don't want to right. disrespect. Power Egg Glass, Toxic Croak, and... No. <laughs> nothing. Oh, wow. Is it going to be one of those... <laughs> One of those uh, videos where like we get almost nothing. I'll try not to jinx it, but uh, we haven't been <laughs> uploading videos in probably like four months or something. And come on, we we can come back to uh, some really good pulls, probably, hopefully. Yeah, some of the recent product uh, has not been too exciting, but come on, these special art rares here or special illustration rares, they're just really amazing. So yeah, right now we're opening the Kingdra one and we've got about, what, five packs, so. It's not that bad. I mean, it's a, I, I think this one is a special, whoop. I think this one here is a special set. So about five packs for like 30 bucks. It's not really bad, but well, something that I definitely have my eyes on is that Sam's Club uh, Crown Zenith box, which is about under $3 per pack, but. It's 2.8, right? Yeah, something like that. Look at that. Some really nice promos, okay. But these are just regular, so. They look uh, pretty chunky. Yeah, I know, right? They. I'm gonna hold them. I don't know if they. Yeah, see, look at that bad quality control here. Like, it's not too good on the side. But on the can, front. Yeah, <laughs> you can kind of see on the front. I don't even it's know so how does that work. Like, the front is There's like so much going on. Fine, but the back is bad. So I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> it doesn't matter because we are not looking for those. And uh, yeah, you guys can keep this code, this code, and uh, wow, look at that. These are special illustrations. They so are they Japanese textured? Waves. Wow, these are textured. I don't even want to touch it because I touched my head. <laughs> these, wow, okay, I did not expect them to be textured, but yeah, no wonder, they're, spe <laughs> they're special illustration promos. Man, Pokemon has finally done it. This is really, really cool. I like this art style too. Is that how the Greninja is? I don't know, but... And the best part of this is that they're gonna be so cheap. So like, if you don't wanna buy the box and you just like the promo, you can probably get them for very cheap. Although, the Greninja was pretty tough to get. Yeah, I don't know why the Greninja box was the one that was a little bit tougher to get because uh, usually we have our websites that we try to buy stuff from. Like, we don't really tr Like, we don't really buy things from the like big retailers, but unless it's like some exclusive stuff or like we really can't find anything online, just because the local stores no, are a little bit it. cheaper. Give it to me. <laughs> Binding mochi. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> it's it's fine, it's fine. Ooh, look at that. I, I like some of this art. That's pretty cool. It scared me. Yeah, but yeah, so normally the uh, local card shops are a little bit cheaper and oh, no. unless it's exclusive stuff, we don't really buy out there. What is Ooh, look at that. Nice. Okay, we're getting some numbered energies. I like those. And uh, here's the code card. That was the DNA experiments on the Pokemon. <laughs> like, look at that. It's like all this. I guess when it's like purple and circles and things. <laughs> kind of makes me feel that way. But yes, <laughs> if I can keep on a topic. The uh, Greninja box was uh, out of stock from a lot of places. I haven't, honestly, like we didn't really do <laughs> that much of a good job at uh, researching, but at least in the like few local stores that we go like go buying stuff which are they're about like five dollars cheaper for the for these uh, boxes uh they didn't have them so we just kind of gave up and bought them in the uh like local like walmart or Target or whichever one has in stock and this one here <laughs> we were lucky to have in stock we've been looking at it for quite a while no like the, the number of energies in uh crown zenith was like they were <laughs> They're kind of easy to pull, but for some reason, that was one of them that we were never able to pull. I think it was the grass energy or something like that. And it just, we just didn't, we just never pulled it. So I had to buy it for like a dollar <laughs> on TCG Player. And then we finally were able to complete our Crown Zenith set. So uh, 
let's take a look and see a little bit later if we can show our binder with crowns in it like finally finally <laughs> completed it took us a long time i mean mostly because i was trying to go about it <laughs> the wrong way i wanted to pull every card and i told him i tried to stop it but no he's very persistent that gets very expensive <laughs> very quickly so um it took us about less than less than an etb <laughs> we spent less than the price of an etb to buy the remaining cards which uh the wallet was very happy but my brain and my my emotions were like but we didn't get these cards mm. it doesn't really feel right <laughs> so yeah we ended up completing so we're definitely gonna make a video showing that binder and how it's i think it's our first ever pokemon set that we've completed it's like I mean, we, it's not the set that we came back to Pokemon in, but we, we came back to Pokemon on, uh, <laughs> what is it, uh, Silver Tempest after tens of years of not being in Pokemon. Yeah, I but, avoided it. I saw the EV stuff like during the COVID time and I'm like, nah, no. Yeah, mostly Pokemon cards though, but we, we do have other, at like least you had expensive. a lot more Pokemon stuff. Like, no. <gasps> Whoa. Okay, I cannot pronounce this. I know, I was so distracted looking at the name. Fazendipidi. Yes. Fazendipidi. Dippy. Fazendipidi. Dippidi. I don't know. <laughs> it's just so oh, bad at this. Okay. What is that? <laughs> there you go. Um, There's a bird. Why all the birds have weird names? I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm what, joking. what is this? this? Is this a special illustration? No, this is a full art. Yeah. You know? Hey, it looks pretty cool. I like it. The newest Pokemon, Fernando. <laughs> <laughs> okay okay this this is probably my favorite box um i don't know you know i don't know if i like the kingdra or the greninja but you uh, just let's answered see. why it's out of stock all the time because you <laughs> liked it more yeah i guess i guess everyone was waiting for this pokemon to have his own thing um i don't know i feel like pokemon oh, so cute. yeah right it's I feel like Pokemon has been giving some love to Greninja because wasn't he like one of the main Pokemons for one of the animes I think and then like we get this box we're actually gonna get like a similar product to hang on uh to what was it the Arceus V-Star box or something that they had on uh, GameStop we're gonna get a similar one that's actually gonna have a metal card uh for Greninja EX so Ooh. the Terra version but <laughs> but it's it's just the ex version it's not actually like anything good it's just a metal regular ex Limited card edition. all right let's take a look at this one here let's start with the the fruit mm -hmm. i want to feed look him at that. isn't he one of the starter pokemons from one of the uh eras i think so i think so i i haven't played that one i think the only one that i played not extensively was no i don't even know i don't remember i bought the don't, game and i don't remember don't, don't continue. <laughs> see the game is not my strong suit so uh, <laughs> yeah these are some pretty nice promos um i like them i like these hollow pattern and then the code card never mind <laughs> that's not what we were looking for like yeah look at that one the greninja ex special illustration promo i guess <laughs> is this supposed to be like a frog lizard uh yeah it's kind of supposed to be a frog and textured yes Tornado. i feel like it's a little bit thicker like i don't i don't know i think i feel, I feel like it's my mind just so kind of like so playing shiny. games in me i like it it got it's, me back into it it's a really good product yeah. in a long time like we definitely it's been needed a year, baby after 151 forgot about everything else uh did we did we stop at 151 so. i don't remember yeah. Uh, I didn't like most of it. Wait, we, we tried what? What is it? This temporal forces. We tried to do some of those, but and that set was a little bit uh, was it Paradox weak. Rift or something? Uh, Paradox Rift, maybe. I don't. It probably, I honestly forgot what's going on. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't, I don't remember the names, but Future. Uh, yeah, Sorry, uh, Binding Mochi <gasps> again. Give it okay. To me. Give it to me. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We can have. <gasps> Whoa! It's a tongue. Oh my God! It's the Wait, River it Room. Like so it's uh, it's another full art, but I think it's a Terra. Full art for the River Room EX. Look at I that. Like it. it looks pretty nice like this. And then it gets all shiny. Yeah. Ooh, it feels like it's got like a golden black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. <laughs> 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 I couldn't help myself. A song, I'd say. <laughs> but it's okay. We're not gonna get into that. Uh, at least, we've, honestly, even though they are just promos, I think those special illustration. Oh. They kind of make it up for some of the pools that we might not have been having, but we definitely got like two full arts. So I'd say that this is a win. At least, 
uh, one yeah. like one big Why pool. Weird? <laughs> no, yeah, it's always like that. Bro, it was weird. <laughs> They're always like that. But yeah, one big pool at least per box would be nice. But so far we are getting some uh, duplicate energies. So numbered energies though, pretty cool. We don't play the game, but if we would play the game, I feel like like just having like a bunch of foil energies would be like really cool. I don't know why. I don't even know how to use energies or how many you need in a game. Isabella, I thought you were talking about playing the Nintendo game. Uh, no, no, the actual TCG game, the actual TCG oh. game. But like, I, I, was I, like, I was like, me too. I would just play like all day long and I stop playing. No, no, just some having, like, having <laughs> some energies. I think it would be pretty nice. Just go but... to the mall and play. <laughs> Wait, what? Again? Another one? <laughs> See, everything's just falling here on the side. <laughs> Anyways, uh, talking about playing the game, uh, there is going to be, I think, the Pokemon uh, TCG Pocket, and that one is going to give us, I think, like two free packs or something. It's digital cards, by the way. So, oh, digital no. cards where you have digital packs that you oh. can buy, hopefully. Oh. I hope those packs are less than $2.8 because that's about how much you can get a Pokemon pack for mm -hmm. uh, since they're digital. I mean, the art is going to be a little bit uh, better. So hopefully they're less than $3 per pack. And we're definitely going to try that as soon as it comes out. But uh, we don't know how it's going to be. And apparently you can play the game there too, but a little bit more of a simplified version of the game. So who knows? Maybe we'll give it a try. Probably a little bit of a not so lucky opening but it's okay i say that definitely just buying this box means a little bit much to pay for a special illustration uh there are promos like not so much for special illustration oh, so cute. but for promos yeah pretty nice oh my oh. god this is so funny <laughs> beware and it's pink beware yeah. I don't know if it's he, but yeah, it's wearing something, so... Sometimes I'm like, do they Beware just of the bear these? wearing. <laughs> that is funny. But yes, at least this box here, even if we didn't have that many good pulls, we had some uh, full arts, which are fine, but the illustrations, the special illustrations, definitely do make up for it. And <laughs> we got the two Genesects one after the other, but at least the illustration for this box. <gasps> wow, let's go! Um, the end of <laughs> I always like when we get one of the full art cards and especially the trainer. So yeah, I want more. I want more. Yeah, we need to open some more 